Hi, and welcome back to the Merg Woods on Let's Play Alundra. So, we're going onwards today. Always good to go onwards. Going backwards, not so great a thing. Um, where am I? No, we're going... Yeah, we ended up going backwards anyway. What can I say? I think we have to go this way. I don't really remember at the moment. Was that the correct way? Just a jump across or something? Jumps to jump to the chest and then up. No, uh, I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going because you know I, I it's been like a week now since I've played this last, so I have no idea. Well, that's definitely not where I'm supposed to be going, unless this is where I'm supposed to be going. In which case, that wouldn't be bad. This might be it. What is happening? Oh yes, earthquake. I vaguely remember this. I remember chests. Not really, but oh look, medical herbs we can't carry anyway. Can we jump down the pits? Also no. Okay, so that was not the way we're supposed to go. Did we get a key? No more bomb. We didn't get a key. Is that the way we're supposed to go? There's a way to find out. There it is, let's see. We can watch myself playing Alundra. Hi, I'm Dr. Michael's play Alundra. Hey, look at that. Yes. Life vessel. Dead end. Right, so where was that dead end from? Alright, so that's where we need to go. So let's do this and cheat and get back to where we started. Hi, and welcome back to Merg Woods on Let's Play Lundra again. We're gonna go forwards and then backwards and jump off a ledge and reopen a chest with a medical herb that we don't need. It's, it's all very complicated and nonsensical. Mushrooms of doom. Helps to hit them. Probably something like stupidly simple like kill the mushroom. That block disappears. It's things like that that I, I wish I would just realize the first time. And they are eating the poor mushroom. Rainer of the swamp lands. Swamp lands even. They're easy enough. I don't know what's up with this mushroom. Step on its head. It looks to be alive. Maybe it's not alive. Who knows? Oh, uh, great. We got a fork in the bridge. switch that I'm going to just miss because I'm killing uh, my Mergles. Merg. Hmm. This guy doesn't look at all suspicious. Yes, I do dare enter your secret den, and I want to steal your boomerang. Yes, go report to Lord Zazen. Secret passage. That leads to nowhere. I guess that's the stone golem that the one Merg was talking about. Okay, it just heads back to where we just came from. More pots, not gonna bother opening. Stone Guardian fight incoming. Boss fight, mini boss fight, who knows? We'll find out here in about two seconds. Or 
apparently he just wasn't that difficult. It just did not look like he was getting hit. That's it. Stone Golem was defeated. I guess that's uh, that was a boss. That was a pathetic boss. That was a mini boss. All right, a mini boss, no big deal. So treasure chest. What do we get? Oh look, something we can't carry. Let's hit the switch anyway. Could be timed. Sprinting, even though it's not really a whole lot faster. What do we have here? Is gonna be we're gonna be meeting Lord Zazen, Zazen, or we may just go back into the door because the door is in the uh, same direction we were traveling, traveling, traveling in previously. Just like stairs, apparently they take sadistic pleasure in uh, having the player walk backwards into the wrong thing. I'm not sure if I've been down there. Oh, hey, it's Boomerang, dude. Hmm. Uh, we killed the Stone Golem already. Yes, go to your portrait, Lord Zazen. And leave me my chest! No! No! Very good, Merc. My chest. To it. Looks like Maya shows up. Oh, look! Awesome treasure! Like in Final Fantasy Mystic Quest, where Phoebe decided that she wanted the cat claw for herself. It's the cat claw. No, it was Tristan. 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 Who wanted the with two bombs. And Phoebe got the upgraded claw because she had the cat claw already. It's random nonsense in games. I still have this wand equipped, it's pretty bad. Hmm. Ah, my chest. Ooh, upgraded bow. Probably just as useless as it was. We'll start checking random caves we come across. Oh, what the hell? As I walk through the door again. This place has a slight mushroom problem, apparently. If I could get this charged. Alright, flail's kinda useless. doorway? Yes, we can. And we have a teleporter, leading to nowhere we can do anything with. Alright, awesome. Oh, look, more mushrooms. Roll, like, half of them in one shot. And I'm so excited and pleased to be able to say also, I just thought of it. I forget what game it was I was playing, I think it was a Lundra. It might have been a treasure adventure game. In, in the midst of a relatively hot day and I was just like roasting to death. It is currently like 105 degrees out, it was like 68 yesterday, so it's a pretty hot damn day. We have the air conditioner on, it's so nice and comfy. Anyone who doesn't have the joys of air conditioning in their home, I do feel sorry for you. Looks like a relatively secret cave. We'll see if we can get over there. Easy enough. As I run into thorns. It's like the story of my life, along with medical herbs and thorn bushes. Oh look, more secret merc gatherings. 
monkey one. I wonder if it's like toilet one. They throw like poo in it or something. Yes, yes I am. Oh, we have to actually activate the monkey to turn on. Unfortunately, the bow is pretty useless still. Even the, the upgraded willow bow we just acquired doesn't really do much in the way of damage. So, back to the sword. Really? Now, what else do you get from SMR? Teleporter. Teleporter to... Switch! Alright. I have a feeling we gotta get this whole pathway clear going horizontally. As I walk into Thornbush again. Why I keep taking damage when I'm burning it? I think the fire is spreading to Alundra. Screw you, monkeys. I'm just gonna, like, run free. I'm not even gonna run around or kill you anymore. Oh, this should be fun so I can dodge the arrow when I exit the screen. No, I can't. And it knocks me back into the teleporter. Awesome. And the money teleported. I am dying. Yeah, those medical herbs heal quite a bit now. I think it's like six or seven. Let's see. Eight, even. Oh, for the love of God. All these? Is that it? I really have no idea. Uh -oh, what do we have here? Alright, cool. Monkeys. And the healing thing doesn't work anymore. Awesome. Let's see where this takes us. That was not at all where I should have gone. So this area has a fuck you ledge. Such moments add absolutely nothing to the game. It's like I've got to backtrack for the sake of backtracking now. Tons of fun. Not really. Well, I hope I don't have to backtrack up too far. Let's go over to where the stone golem was again. Back to where the stone golem was. He's already defeated. The block didn't respawn, which is good. enough the experiment apparently or there okay this is where I just was before I jumped down like a moron I must have gone this way huh <sighs>
and they're screwing the frickin... <sighs> A door above you should remain above you. Yes, hit the switch and close the door on me. Told you did not see that coming. Not at all in the slightest. Cheeky little bastard just jumping all over, making me hit you twice. Twice even. That's it. That's all that was in there. There's a few of you in here. Let's see if I can get them all to group up and just like nuke all of them at once. Yeah, it's take a kill on them. Just gonna kill them. Don't really kill them. Seriously? Couldn't get the last one. Oh, that opened up a secret passage. It's not it's a real secret. It opened up a passage. Switches have deactivated. So I take it, I have to do all these in, in like one shot without leaving. setting again. Hey, hey, I think we got it. Just down to the left and back up. I thought this was the cave I needed. Apparently not. What was this? I thought this was the one. Let's go find out. Alright, monkeys move. Monkey wine, yeah, we heard this already. Looks like they all stayed in the same spot at least, so as soon as I remember which door or which entrance rather I need to take, I should be able to get up there. Here somewhere. As I burn myself again. This was the cave. I hope. I, I don't know. Mushrooms. Teleporter. I think this is it. Come on, be it. I'm gonna think everyone is it until I actually find it. All right, good, good, and good. Perfect. We are through. And we're probably gonna have to fight something. Or not. Or maybe. What your frickin' monkey toilet one? Yeah, this plan worked out wonderfully, Alundra. Run away from the monkey and run into like 20 of them. Okay, this is actually a. Uh... That's a, actually kind of a crazy fight. You know, I got arrows flying all over the place. Probably one of the first legitimately. Uh, not legit. Leg yeah, words. Legitimately, reasonably difficult fights in the game. Not get his boomerang. That sucks. Oh well. 
It is what it is. That's going to be it for this episode of Let's Play Lundra. Next time, we'll continue through to hopefully the last part of the Murgwoods, because all the thorn bushes and frickin' ninja monkeys are getting on my nerves. Feel free to come and rate, subscribe, and have a great day. And I totally recorded this entire episode with my mouse on the screen, didn't I? You probably won't see it after I take it out and edit it. Have a great day.